Hi, I'm Jason Cohen from Cohen Engineering, and today I'd like to talk a little bit about main shafts for the Turbo, Turbo 400 transmission. Um, the main shaft is often possibly an overlooked part of the Turbo 400. As robust in design as the Turbo 400 is, the, uh, the main shaft is nestled down in the center of the transmission, and all the power has to travel through it. The OEM GM main shaft, as I'm showing here, is a fairly crude piece, uh, poor machining, uh, pretty low end material selection, and several stress risers that make it uh, a poor choice for high horsepower applications. You can see that the uh, termination of the splines as they lead up to the bushing journals happens in a uh, smaller diameter or an undercut. Uh, the oil holes are drilled very abruptly, uh, no treatment to them. Uh, again, another undercut here at the end of the splines. So we offer several upgrades or enhancements uh, to this main shaft. Our first level of upgrade is manufactured from 300M back arc remount grade steel. Um, much better machining, much better surface finish on the shaft. The undercuts at the termination of the splines uh, where it meets up with the bushing journal. Um, the undercut is eliminated in lieu of the splines being rolled instead of hobbed or shaped. All of our oil holes uh, have coining done at the entrance so that uh, the uh, leading edge of the hole is rounded. And again, you can see on this end as well, no, no undercut because the splines have been rolled. Uh, we offer this particular shaft in another upgrade. Uh, we call it our super shaft. It's exact same geometry on the part but um, an aerospace grade alloy as opposed to 300M. So that's one step up. Next step up is what we call our torsional super shaft. Again, we're using the aerospace alloy, but we've made some additional geometry changes to the shaft, still utilizing rolled splines, so no undercuts on either end. But in this instance, no oil holes in the main barrel diameter of the shaft. All the oil holes have been positioned close to the journals an additional oil hole added to provide more oil to the sun gear at the rear of the transmission. And we, we term this the torsional shaft because the main barrel of the shaft has actually been reduced in diameter and strategically designed to add torsional compliance in order to reduce some stress that would typically lead, lead to failures in these oil holes. So designing twist into this shaft to keep it from breaking. This would be the uh, ultimate uh, solution before you go to what we call our XST main shaft kit. We are the only company in the industry that offers a larger than standard main shaft. It does require a kit be purchased from us that includes a special center support that is sized appropriately to allow this shaft to be used uh, and also requires use of our planetaries, our XST planetaries. This shaft is an inch and an eighth in diameter, 35 splines instead of the conventional 30, and it's solid in design. No oil holes anywhere on the shaft, no hole drilled through the center of the shaft. Requires, uh, again, uh, use of our specific center support, which implements General Motors 4L80 center lube technology, where the oil being returned from the oil cooler is introduced into the center of the transmission and fed directly to the planets. So it requires no holes be drilled in the main shaft. So hopefully that sheds a little light on the main shaft in the Turbo 400 transmission.